Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part three of Let's Play Bloodborne. Alright, I decided to go back downstairs and fight a whole lot of those mobs off screen. But I don't want to go to the lantern because I could respawn all of them again. And I don't want to do that. Also, while I was walking around, it turns out you can talk to somebody through a window, too. Oh, you must be a hunter. And not one from around here, either. I'm Gilbert, a fellow outsider. You must have had a fine time of it. Yarnum has a special way of treating guests. I noticed. Well, I don't think I could stand if I wanted to, but I'm willing to help. If there's anything that can be done. <laughs> this town is cursed. Whatever your reasons might be, you should plan a swift exit. Whatever can be gained from this place, it will do more harm than good. Pale blood, you say? Hmm. Never heard of it. But if it's blood you're interested in, you should try the Healing Church. The Church controls all knowledge on blood ministration and all varieties of blood. Across the valley to the east of Yarnum lies the town of the Healing Church, known as the Cathedral Ward. And deep within Cathedral Ward is the old Grand Cathedral, the birthplace of the Healing Church's special blood. Or so they say. <laughs> yeah, well, I don't have a compass, so I don't know which way is east. don't share much with outsiders. Normally, they wouldn't let you near the place, but... The hunt is on tonight. This might be your chance. Across the valley to the east of Yarnum, you'll deep within. I haven't heard. Okay, so I'm not getting much else. But at least I know I have a goal in mind. Head for the Cathedral Ward and get to the Healing Church. So yeah, I had to fight all of these on my own because I don't want to subject you guys to this again and again if I can help it. So I might have to try a different route because going past the wolves has not been working for me. What if there's another way to go? Lads, you have come on. Lads, you have come <laughs> Some things never change. Oh, sweet. I finally got a cocktail again. So I used up all of them last time. Still want nothing to do with that big door over there. That's just bad news bears. Alright, so we're back here again. I wonder if there's something I missed over this way. Because it looks like I can go around this? I can't. I thought I found a different route to go. But I guess I didn't. Well, let me keep looking around. There might be something I can take advantage of. Like, maybe down here? If I can get there? Aha! I don't think I've been this way. What's so funny? I don't reckon you're from around here. Well... Oh. Oh, the one that blows the raspberry. Yeah, I think I have talked to this one before. That looks pretty dangerous. Lots of doggos. Well, I can always beat them up when they're defenseless. Try to deal with this now, huh? Oh! What the hell is that one doing? Do you know how stairs work, pupper? Okay, that one does. I don't know how many more doggos there are. So I better be careful. Could go up this way, because I haven't been here before. Oh jeez, another one of those big boys. Let me go up instead. 
a dead end. Cold blood do. As long as that jabroni doesn't corner me, I'm good. Although I wouldn't be surprised if I have to fight him eventually. Actually, let me go down to the rest of this area where the dogs were. That might be a better idea. Because I can handle dogs. Better that I can handle some dude with a hatchet. Well, this is an easy way to get some blood echoes, when you agree? I'm down with that. Anything that makes it a little bit easier for me. I'm satisfied. Three more cold blood dues. I'll find a use for them soon enough. I'm just gonna hold off on that for later. What the hell? No! Get back up! Ow! How dare you! Why are you knocking back? So what would it be? Are you going to tell me you're not? Oh, I should have known. Yes, good for nothing. No respect for the elderly is what that is. That not good you outside is do. I don't have a choice. Go on. Admit it. You think we're all mad, don't you? This town is cursed. So what is it now? I have much better ways to pass the time. Unless you found me a nice safe place. I think I'll have to find one later. I think I'll return and pay her a visit once I find that so-called safe place. Maybe this is it. It's pretty big. It's indoors. Maybe an open window. Oh, this just leads back to the sewer. Yeah, I think this is the sewer. Okay, maybe this place is not so safe after all. I want to go through this house. I might as well. It's it's new. It's new territory. All the same. Let me go deal with this jabroni pony first. Before I start operating any devices! And there has to be a sharpshooter. And I use that term loosely. Alright, guess I'm gonna have to deal with you too, huh? At least the bullets move rather slow. So that's in my favor. Oh, more cold blood do. Good to know there's no cap for it. Can I do anything with this? Hmm. Surprisingly, no. I think we're on the top part of the sewers. Uh-oh. I don't see anything else to operate. Just waiting for him to attack. Oh! Let's go for another one! That slow wind-up. What the frick? Oh, you're all kinds of useless today. 
be on the other side of this place, anyway. What's the good to come here? I don't see a shortcut of any kind. Do we see a ladder? That's just a normal place to descend. Yeah, I think this is the waterway. At least I think it is. I feel like I'm not really getting anywhere in all this. Nope, nope, this definitely is new. I would have picked that item up. Alright, now we got another sniper to eliminate. Nice! That's how you avoid getting shot. Yeah, this is a different spot. Like, What can be good about going this way? I feel like I'm going everywhere except where I need to go. Whoa! That one didn't die. Damn. Another one! God, that's a lot of crows. So many crows, so little time. <laughs> Actually, I got lots of time. I just don't want to spend all of it going for the kill, you know? And I could be using it to keep myself alive. Two oil urns, um, thanks, I guess. It doesn't really help towards my goal, and that's make more progress in this place. Definitely don't want to drop down there. That seems like a horrible idea. Even if I could drop there, I don't think I could survive the plunge. How is it I've not created another shortcut since then? This place is so large. And it's only the first major area. But I am enjoying the game. Like, just because it's hard doesn't mean it's not fun. So I think I'll just have to retrace my steps. That might be the only way to go. The opening is around here, is it? Yes. Okay. So there's nothing special down here. I think I grabbed all the goodies on this side of the room. I don't know if there's a ladder to climb back up once I'm done. I'd probably just end up falling and have to work my way around the long way again. Oh! I forgot to grab that. Oh, it's just there waiting for me. So let's not go down the window. Instead, we'll just have to go find her a safe haven. I thought I would have found one, but I guess I didn't yet. So I'll just have to keep being on the lookout for one. So I might have to fight that uh, goon with the hatchet again. I think that's what I'm going to have to do to make progress. Did I already go up this way? I think this was the dead end, right? Yeah, because the stairs were smashed. So I have two choices. We'll try this one first. This looks like it leads to a house. Which I can enter. Oh. So much of this place being safe. Oh. Hello. Oh god. He's got a blunderbuss. Thanks for the bullets, dummy. <laughs> What's this? 
When the haunt began, the healing church left us, blocking the great bridge to Cathedral Ward, as old Yarnum burned to the ground that moonlit night. Okay, it's just a bit of lore. Well, thank God that dude with the wheelchair didn't shoot my brains out. That would have been a horrible way to go. <laughs> Now where am I? Oh! Have I been here before? Like maybe I didn't try to go in that door, or maybe that door was locked at the time. I don't feel like I've been here. Wait. Hold on a second. Aha! All right, we opened that gate. Across the valley, deep within, I have a basket. <laughs> mm, so much for finding Nana a safe place. All right, so now we could just go through the house, like so. That'll be less trouble. Actually, speaking of trouble, these two are gonna be nothing but trouble. Let me see if I can only get one of them over to me. Come on. Come on, you know you want it. Let's go. No, I'm not done with you. Now I'm done with you. You want some of this too? Of course you do. Go away. That's how it's done. It's amazing how much your confidence can change if you got the timing right for stuff. Where the hell is this from where I've been before? Hold on, is that the same bridge that had the wolves? I can't tell from here. This definitely looks like uncharted territory. Let me see what this... Oh, it's currently inoperable. So I can't do anything with that way yet. I just went here for nothing. Well, ain't that a kick in the teeth. Okay, so I know where this is. I don't see any reason to still go in the underground part yet. But at least now we've made a little bit of progress in shortcut creating. So that's a step in the right direction. Thinking I might have to deal with those freaking wolves. But I think I'm going the wrong way again, aren't I? Was it up the stairs? I don't have to go up a set of stairs. No, I think that's where I dropped from. I see. I got it now. Yeah, so now I gotta go back the long way. Alright, so that might be a pointless shortcut. No, it has to be a shortcut that's effective, right? Otherwise, why would I even open the gate if I can't go back? There has to be a way back. Where would that way be? Is it underground? Or up here? I think I gotta go up a lot of stairs. Oh, that's the stairs that I... That was busted. Where the frick do I go now? Please tell me that was not a pointless shortcut to even create at all. It can't be pointless. There had to be a reason to do what I did. 
Like, that's supposed to be a really good shortcut to allow me to progress. Right? So where do I go to progress? So that I can say it is progress, you know? It's not up here, is it? What about down here? How do I get this device to work? Does it ever work? I'm not even sure. I guess I'll just have to retrace my steps again, because this is starting to tick me off. Alright, let me go down through here again. This might be the way I need to go. If not, then that's a pretty shitty shortcut. Like, I could be overlooking something extremely obvious. Because if this is not a shortcut, then it's probably longer than the route I was normally taking. I gotta be missing something extremely obvious. I got to. That's the only explanation I have. Then maybe I'm just overthinking it. Uh, I guess I'll climb down the ladder and see how dangerous it really is. Like, if it's rats, I can deal with rats. It's probably gonna be rats. Or maybe this waterway has nothing. So it's definitely not the same waterway I was on before. No, definitely not. He's better not all wake up. Uh-oh. They are waking up. But the good news is they're very slow. Like, they don't even stand. They have to crawl. So I can keep picking them off at a whim. How are there still so many of them, though? Holy crap! <laughs> well, that's the last of them. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Ah, there's still more down here. I don't even know. Whoa! The crows now. That's the first time the crows even hit me, and they hit me for a ton. Damn! No wonder their attack patterns are so slow. They're just extremely volatile if they do hit you. Well, thankfully it's not like the depths in Dark Souls 1. Because that plays at freaking basilisks. And that place was not a good time. You know, in that game, the Basilisk can curse you. And curse was a terrible status to have. Yeah, I know you're gonna pop up and attack. Wow! Very telegraph slap. This is the third episode, and I'm still only in the beginning part, pretty much. That. More crows. Go away. So I can climb up here. But is that where I need to go? Uh, that might be the way I might want to go. 
I don't like the looks of that giant rat there. It's way too much of uh, bubonic for me. Where the hell is this? Am I on the other side of the bridge? Or am I on the other side of that mechanism? Oh, here we go! Currently inoperable. Aha! This will lead back to that... to this area. So I'm guessing the lever will just call the elevator now. The button might have to be the manual override to get it moving. Maybe this is the shortcut I have. Oh, hello. This might be a bad time. For them? What the hell? Oh, thank God I got away from that. That is pretty scary. Hope he doesn't have another one. Look at him. Like, Are you sure you want some of this? Come on. Come on, you're scared. You're a coward. Come on. Come on, big boy. Oh, you gave in to peer pressure, and that's what you get. That's what you get for trying to chuck rocks at me. And instead, only hit your own minions. Yeah, I think this is the way I need to go. I mean, look at all this. It's another ladder. Uh, let's go forward first. I want to see what's at the end. Going in this direction. Okay, on second thought, maybe we'll take the ladder. Because if I have a good idea of where this actually goes, I might create a shortcut. Wait. Is this where the big rat is? I think so. I think that was the uh, same tunnel I saw the big rat. So this is looking like a no-go to me. <laughs> Let's just hedge our bets and go the other way. I don't think I'm ready to be taking on anything hulking just yet. Look at that tree over there. That's so huge. Just sticking out of the roof. This looks like it's just for an item. So maybe I'll ignore it for now. Oh, cutscene. Charming fellow, this guy is. Uh, why well, have a feeling this is a boss? This might be a bad idea. You're a nice looking mouth breather, aren't you? Father Gaskyong! Oh, he's got a gun as well. Oh, it's a five way shot!
Oh god, he's not flinching in my attacks either. I don't think I was supposed to fight this guy yet. Why can't I shoot? I have my gun out. That is so weird. Oh my god. Well, at least I can parry him, too. Hey, maybe I'll get lucky with this. Oh my god. Gotta find the right opening. Start. I'm doing okay for the most part. If I can keep doing attacks like this, I think we can get him. Oh, what's that smell? The sweet blood. Oh, it seems to me it's enough to make a man sick. Oh, great. <laughs> oh, God, he mad. Oh my god, I might actually beat him! Holy shit! Okay, well at least I staggered him. But I was too late. Oh no, now what? Oh Jesus! He just changed form! Okay, I say one more of those and he's done. Got him! Haha! <laughs> First try! Ray slaughtered. The Adon Tomb Key. And I got a trophy for that. Holy shit! I didn't even mean to run into a boss and then all of a sudden I managed to win. Okay, now it looks like I got an eye idol right there. You see that? Under my blood echoes? I don't know what that is. I don't know if that's like Dark Souls, how they treat humanity or something. Which in that case, I'm surprised I managed to win. Whoa! The doll actually stood up. Hello, good hunter. I am a doll, here in this dream to look after you. Honorable hunter, pursue the echoes of blood, and I will channel them into your strength. You will hunt beasts, and I will be here for you, to embolden your sickly spirit. Channel blood echoes? Use Blood Echoes to raise stats and level Hello. up, finally! Let the Echoes become your strength. Let me stand close. Now shut your eyes. Okay, so the eye symbol is called Insight. What is Insight? Level of Insight or Debt of Inhuman Knowledge. Needed to ring special bell, but induces frenzy. What the hell is frenzy? Resistance to lower frenzy, the higher this attribute, the more resistant you are. Okay. So vitality is for health. Endurance is for stamina and resistance. Strength, of course, is heavy physical weapon attack. Determines whether or not you can use certain equipment. Skill is kind of like dex. So you need to have high dex for certain weapons. Blood Tinge is the power of weapons that use Quicksilver bullets. Determines whether or not you can use certain equipment, like certain guns. And Arcane is the governing power of Arcane Attack. So Arcane Weapons, for instance. Discovery, of course, is the odds of you finding items. 
Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Oh, so I can level up six times. Okay, what do I need? I think I'll put two points in strength. Maybe two more in vitality. And I'm thinking one point in endurance and a point in blood tinge. Yep, th that's what I'm going to go with. It's going to be very costly, but now I have a good use for my blood echoes. <laughs> Farewell, good hunter. May you find your worth in the waking world. Okay, I would like to go back to that bridge in Central Yarnum to deal with those wolves. But now that I'm able to level up, it will be a lot easier. You know, it wouldn't be a bad idea to buy some more cocktails, too. What else can I buy from you other than armor? I don't know if this Yarnum equipment would be better than the Hunter equipment. <laughs> So I wouldn't mind buying that anyway, and then assessing it based on what I need. So let's stop the video here, and in the next part, I... Wait, accept gift? Consume insight and ring the beckoning bell to enlist the cooperation of hunters from other worlds. Silencing blank and such forms of cooperation. Wait, is there another gift right here? Zoom inside and ring the old hunter bell to enlist the cooperation of old hunters. Oh, we can go in here now. Aha. You must be the new hunter. Welcome to the hunter's dream. This will be your home. For now. I am... Gammon friend to you hunters you're sure to be in a fine haze about now but don't think too hard about all of this just go out and kill a few beasts it's for your own good just kill a you few. know it's just what hunters do you'll get used to it this was once a safe haven for hunters a workshop where hunters used blood to enhance their weapons and flesh. We don't have as many tools as we once did, but you're welcome to use whatever you find. Oh, is this where I go to upgrade my weapon? Should it please you. This was what the work you'll need. Okay, so how do I use that anyway? Memory altar? The workshop tool required for this task is missing. Oh. To escape this dreadful hunter's dream, halt the source of the spreading scourge of beasts, lest the night carry on forever. Hold on, how do I... attach things to my weapons? I don't know if there's a way to do so yet. I mean, I could use these to level up more. How much does a cold blood do do for me? No, I don't mean to actually use it or equip it. I want to use it. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Huh. Yeah, let's remove that. Uh... Actually, I'm better off just using this. Use can gain a large amount. I think I'll save that for later. That gets me 350. And this one... A thousand! Okay. So 
So a little bit more of this opened up. Wonder if I can use this as a safe haven for that old woman. That might be something to look into for now. Welcome. What is it? Very well. Let me. Okay, I still need more to level up again. But you know what? I think that's fine. Storage. Place items in storage or retrieve stored items. Okay, abandoned weapon to fortify. Okay, it doesn't let me embed it here. Maybe it's in here? Oh, workshop! Fortify weapons using bloodstones. Okay, do I have enough? I can even upgrade the pistol. Use 240 echoes and bloodstone shard times three. Well, it's a good thing I have them. And I can do that again. You know what? We'll make it a Hunter X plus two. And nothing needs repairs. Now my weapons do more damage. Okay, I think we're making a step in the right direction. All the same. So I think we'll stop here, and in the next part, I say we'll go back to Central Yarnum and take care of business. See everyone, thanks for watching.